We go from one of the winningest programs in tournament history to a school starting its own legacy, UMass. Yeah! 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 Felt fake. It just hit me this morning. Uh, it was an unbelievable experience. It was a total team effort. Uh, not one person didn't help out, no matter whether they were playing or not. Huge group effort. We had our goaltenders playing, um, goaltender playing unbelievable. And it was just an unbelievable experience. Words can't describe the feeling for both games. Um, we just, you know, told them, got to keep it going. Leave a Friday's game in, in Friday. Keep that energy, though, coming into Saturday's game. And we kind of just told them that, the thing that always kept us down in the back, the past, playing Norwich was their name. wasn't anything, any sort of particular skill set. It was the name that they carried that kind of kept us down in the past. But I think we just kept that in the back of our mind that we're more than capable of playing with them, if not clearly beating them. So um, I think having four defense was definitely tough. Um, I've never had my legs been so tired in my life. Um, we knew we had to take short shifts, keep them quick, keep our legs moving, keep them rested. Um, we have um, a lot of faith in each other. We've been doing four defense for the last two months now, so we've had some pretty big wins with it. So we knew we could do it. We, weren't, we didn't really think too much about them being ranked. That didn't matter to us. We knew they were going to be tough, but we also knew we're mentally and physically tougher than both of those teams, and I think we proved that this weekend. Uh, the NESCAC League is definitely a good league. We've played a bunch of them. Um, they're definitely going to be tough, but I think playing a bunch of their teams, we know how good they can be and how we can skate with them and play against them and potentially beat them. So hopefully we'll be able to do that this weekend.